Hey guys, today we're just going to be taking a quick look at the My D Link Home um, product range. Um, I got sent a few of these to test out and just really have a play around with. Um, as per my reviews, I like to test products extensively. Um, I don't just you know use them for a day. I like to use them for a good few weeks. Um, these did turn up before I went on holiday to the Peak District, but I just wanted to kind of talk about what they are. Um, this isn't the full review yet. This is more just a sneaky peek um, that you can read, kind of find out a little bit more about the products. Um, the first product I kind of wanted to talk about was the, um, the Smart Plug. Now, the Smart Plug, I think, is going to be one of their main sellers. Um, you basically plug it into the wall, um, and then you plug uh, anything into the other side, and you can control it by Wi-Fi. Um, all of these products you can set up with schedules, so you can tell devices to turn on on particular days, turn off. Um, so that's quite cool and it's all controlled via, uh, you can use an Android app or a Apple app and they also have this website that you can go on to um, perhaps view your camera feeds and stuff. Um, I'm not going to talk about pricing at the moment, I'm just going to kind of talk about what you can use these for. So the smart plug, again, plug that you plug into wall and whatever you want will turn on when you want. They have this um, music, music anywhere um, plug which you basically plug into the wall um, and then you plug the other end into your media output so uh, maybe speakers and you can basically play music via your Wi-Fi um, so you could be on your smartphone and you might want to change the music um, I'm still a bit of a I like my traditional media setups maybe I'll use a Raspberry Pi or something uh, but it's an interesting product um, and I feel like a lot of people might actually get use from it. Um, it's a cheap way to kind of just automate your, uh, your media system. Um, the next product they sent me was the motion sensor. Um, the motion sensor basically just gives you um, updates um, via like push notifications on your phone. So you can see who is, well, I would, I'd say see who is, but kind of um, every time someone gets into your house, perhaps you've left your house alone for a week and you want to monitor that, it's something the product can do. Um, I did think of a few funny uses for a few of these products, but um, that's besides the point. The last product they sent me was the um, D-Link kind of camera. <coughs> this is a 720p camera with up to 5 meters of night vision kind of uh, video recording capabilities. So it's an interesting product, and these are all interesting products because I think we're getting to the point in the digital age where um, we want stuff like this. We want to be able to uh, turn on our toaster from upstairs whilst we're in bed. Um, 